Hey you, it's Jess here and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a, an odd unboxing, but this is the Villa Beautiful Advent Calendar. Um, it was her November um, kit, and she does monthly kits, but she made this one Advent themed. Um, but it's a bit weird that I'm unboxing it now, but she did ship it out on time, but there was a two-week postal strike in Finland, and then it just... I don't know, it kind of got weirdly lost. It did get shipped with the Sadie Stickers one, but then, I don't know, it just got lost in the the milieu of all the custom stuff that they were behind. So I finally got it today, and it is the, well, it was delivered in my post office at the 31st of December, but I wasn't able to pick it up until today. It's January 3rd, 4th, I don't know. <laughs> Who knows what day it is? Uh, but yeah, so... We're finally going to open this. It's going to be its own video just so you can... We are opening 12 little packages and I just thought it would be fun to open it. It's not specifically Christmas themed, I don't believe. So let's get straight into it. It came in this really pretty box. And Heidi is, it, <laughs> is joining us as per usual. Um, when we open it up, we have some beautiful Villa Beautiful um, tissue paper and then all of the goodies inside. So let's take it all out. Do you want to be in the box, Heidi? You don't want to be in the box? Are we going where? Are we going in the box? We're in the box. If I fits, I sits. Alright. Heidi's <laughs> lying in the box. I think we can um oh yes. She's so fluffy. Okay, I think we can move it to this side. She's going to enjoy the box of life while we open up all of these goodies. Okay. Heidi, here, let's have a look at the numbers. We have three, six, so we have nine, ten. Um, does this have a number? That's twelve. This is very interesting. Um, despite it being so late, I've actually avoided the majority of um, spoilers. She has already put in the shop the leftovers um, but uh, and photos are up but I kind of just glaze my eyes over them so I don't really notice um, I've seen like the colors and things but not like I haven't really looked at the individual items so this really pretty cute plastic envelope that kept all of the extra pieces inside so let's have a look and we have um, I don't know if it's supposed to count down or what, but I'm going to do from 1 to 12. So let's find 1, shall we? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Alright, so let's open up 1, shall we? So pretty. I mean, she did post up sort of like what the theme was going to be so you get an idea make sure you get everything out so the first item are these tool bow paper clips and oh my god look how sparkly and beautiful they are those are cute I'm just going to open them because I want to look although they're just glitter it's time for the glitter parade my friends Yes, that is the first item on the really big um, paper clips that are my favorite. So cute. I love a glittery tool. That's number one. Number two. This is really cute and fun. We got some washi. So we have here, we have some rose gold. So washi or is overlays. I think we're going to have to open this up. Let's get the tools out here. <laughs> so this is one tip I think I got from Jessenia, where you sort of squeeze it to get the plastic and then do a cut and then you can open it. So you obviously have like a glitter head overlay and then this is 15 a millimeter. There we go. Have a look at what this is. Don't you chew up my things, Heidi. Oh, so it is an overlay. 
a foil overlay in rose gold of the really pretty beauty items. Try and like, that's not going to zoom in the right place. There you go. You can see that. Really cute. So obviously we have it in the 15 millimeter bottom washi and we have some um, headers here as well, header size. So that is a really cute little washi overlays, I should say. So we have number three. Do you want to keep a little Heidi involved here? Alright, number three, I believe there's a few pens here. So, well, Villa Beautiful is known for her pens, so that's why I bought it because I'm like, pens! So, we got our first pen. Oh, that's really pretty. We got an, um, an extra insert for it. She's a great gel ink, straight out of the bag. <gasps> It's beautiful. So you have this beautiful blush pink in a matte um, um, barrel and then you have the rose gold hardware and some really pretty soft peachy um, crystals. So pretty. So that is the uh, number three, our first pen. So let's open number four. I think usual kits only come with one pen. So. Yeah, I saw that there was three pens in here. So we have a notepad, and so it's pretty notes. I think the theme was all the pretty things. So you have really pretty girly shelves here, and really nice big notepad with um, rose gold there. Really cute. I always need a post, a notepad. Number five. We have some little dainty stickers. Now I believe she makes these so they could be nail decals or you can stick them onto your pens to decorate them like around the bar on the barrel or on the uh, I think a lot of people put them on the metal bit there so you can have like a little um, you can put some bows and uh, bows, little handbags um, little sort of serum bottles, um, lipsticks, little heart with wings, your little shoes. So you could decorate your um, pens with this in rose gold. Sorry, Heidi loves the <laughs> some of this stuff. Oh, you want to open these, do you? <laughs> so now we've got number six, which I believe is another pen. You can tell from the packaging. Oh, you squish on your nose. Make sure you get the little inserts that come with them. Always useful. Oh, so we got a purple pen. Yes. Love purple. So again, we have the matte barrel and the rose gold hardware. And this has sort of the pink and the hollow clear crystals. Really, really pretty. Love that pen. No, we're not up to 12 yet. We're not up to 12 yet. <laughs> Uh, we're going to do seven now, Heidi. Seven, yes. We're going to open seven. So, oh, she's getting uh, impatient. <laughs> so we have the sticker book um, that comes with her kits usually. Heidi send over. Uh, if she tears some tissue paper in a second, I apologize. Uh, we have the sticker book here, so you get a whole bunch of stickers. Let's have a look through it. She's being a little bit, okay, she's grabbing me. <laughs> um, so, oh, this is like a really pretty professional sticker book. First you get this little set of little decos with the pens, really pretty. We have some Erin Condren full boxes all with the rose gold. I adore pretty things. Live a little sparkle everywhere you go. It's little things in life. Live, laugh, sparkle. And then you have some circular icons. Um, pay bills, things like that. It's a lot it's similar to an Erin Condren sticker book, I feel like. Um, or her, um, a um, Happy Planner one. And so you have some weekly boxes here, some clipboards, some half boxes. You have some sort of header things, some strips here, Hello Weekend, some scallop boxes. You have some more pretty deco. You have some date covers. 
You have some little bits and pieces and flags and arrows. You have some strips here, some little boxes. Oh, this is like um, a Hobonichi Weeks kit right here. So you have the Bonawashi and the deck covers and everything. Really cool. So that is the sticker book. Really pretty. We're going to do number eight. Heidi's getting um, impatient. So here we have an enamel charm. So it's on a black um, bull chain and it's a bow with a crystal. Really pretty. Your nine, I think this is the last pen. So really cute pen so far. So you have the inside out. Ooh, and the pen is like a slate taupe, like a, a darker brownie taupe. Have a look at this. Also, again with the matte barrel. Doesn't want to come out. Come on, come on. So similar to the other pens, but with that sort of slate taupe uh, matte barrel. Really, really pretty. Love those three pens. We're getting to the end now. We've got ten. This feels a lot squishier. Ooh, I think I heard some people comment about this, but yes, it comes out. I think you put it in, inside out. I don't know how to do uh, Yes, pull it inside out. Am I doing this right? Yes. Aha! It is a recycle. It is a um, shopping bag. But like out of recycled materials sort or of thing. And that becomes a little pocket. Oh my god, that's so cute. And you can put your shopping in there. Anything you need a reusable bag for. Heidi is loving this one. So that is a really cool idea to have in the kit. I love using those. I love mine from Erin Condren, but that one's really nice and easy to tuck away. So 11. We have, um, this is a pen holder. So you got one of those sort of more springy ones for the pen holders and then it has the pretty um, enamel. And obviously you can, uh, you can clip it on to whatever you need, dashboard, whatever, to hold your pen. Really cute. All right, now we're to the final one. So exciting, the whole thing. Ooh. A pretty dusty pink. This is really beautiful. The silver silver zip. Oh, cool! It's like a folio that holds things, so you can fill this with pens or stickers or anything that you want. This is awesome. I think this will be perfect for my traveling coming up. Like if I want to fit four things, so can you fit the? Maybe put the pens in this back pocket. Oh, and then they fit like entirely inside. But then you can put stickers and stuff in here. That's really cool. And I like how it's silver hardware instead of rose gold. Because I'm not much of a rose gold girl, honestly. But that was awesome. Oh, now Heidi's seen all the things she's left. <laughs> she's like, I've seen it all. Let me just compile this together and we can have a chat. Okay, here we have everything together. I think it was a beautiful box. I wish I had been able to open it over Christmas, um, but I'm still super duper happy. It was so beautiful to see it all together and open it up with you guys and Heidi. <laughs> but I think this is a really, really worthwhile box. And I think she's very similar usual monthly kits. I think only one pen usually comes with those. Um, but you get a different variety of items like these little decal stickers. You always get the sticker book, notepads, little enamel pieces, um, and the folio is really generous and um, really useful and simple. Um, yeah, I really, really loved this advent box. I thought it was gorgeous. I think um, if I like more themes in the future, I definitely would pick up her monthly sets because this is amazing. It's great quality. Um, let me quickly look up how much it cost. Sorry guys, I'm just going to insert this very randomly, so I apologize for that. But I forgot to say that we also got 
digital papers and items that we can print ourselves. And these were sent back when they were, um, uh, when it was mailed to me, so I've had the digital printables for ages, but we get did get a bunch of printables um, So that was really awesome too. So that's also added to the cost. <laughs> Just want to add that in. All right We'll finish the video now. All right. I finally found it you guys. It was um, $62.99 so it was pretty expensive. I'll be very honest with you. Uh, I kind of splurged on it for Christmas time <laughs> Um, but you did get three whole pens and like the folio and the recycled bag, which you can use quite a lot. So, sorry, Heidi's being very annoying right now. Come on. Anywho, so yes, it was fairly expensive. I don't think her monthly kits are this expensive, but it was very beautiful and it had quite a lot of. Um, high priced uh, items. I think these three together are like $30 all together um, plus the other extra items. So yes, I think it was gorgeous and it was only late because of the finished strike. It was sent out properly for everyone else and Heidi loves it. So, <laughs> um, But if you like this video, don't get, forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more. Um, I hope you have a wonderful week, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Say bye, Heidi. Say bye, Heidi. Bye, bye. Yes.